we have negative 5x cubed times y squared squared. So I should write this twice. Now that I have a product of factors, I can regroup the bases that are like. So I have two negative fives, two x cubes, and two y squareds multiplied together. That would have been the same if I would have just distributed the square to each of the terms. I would have had two negative fives, two x cubes, and two y squareds. Now that I'm here, I can multiply my numbers together and my bases together. Negative five times negative five is positive 25 times two is 50. For the base of x, I simply add the exponents together. 3 plus 3 makes 6, and 7 makes 13. The y's are a little bit easier, so I just have y to the 4th. Altogether, I have 50 times x to the 13th times y to the 4th. If you reasoned your way somewhat through that, or got any of these exponents right, great job. If you got this right on your first try, that's even more impressive. Great work.